I'm back. Um, so really quickly, I'm really sorry that there's nothing being posted since my last my singing video. Just a lot has gone on lately. Like I had um, some problems at work, a drama happening over there, which was fun. Um, I had my dad's got COVID a minute, which is very very difficult. Um, but thankfully he's he's doing okay. He's uh, getting through it nicely. That's the right word for it. Um, but yeah, so he's on the mend. He's halfway through it now, which is good news. Um, so yeah, that's a little bit about that. So that's why I've been a bit, little bit preoccupied because I've stopped me in the mindset to do anything. But today, um, my postman came to me and uh, he gave me a, a very, very big parcel, which I was very, very looking forward, looking forward to. Um, and uh, before I show you what the parcel is, I'm going to tell you what I've been doing. So obviously, uh, this is how, since I'm in isolation, um, I, have, I think I've got six days, six days left of it. Just <laughs> counting down the days, honestly. So sick of being in the house. Um, but yeah, so obviously I've, I've had a lot of free time. So I did some Googling. I keep seeing on TikTok and stuff about Agora. I thought, I want to give this a try. I want to see what it's like. Buy two boxes and see what I get. And like, you know, just uh, give my honest opinion about it and my views and stuff. So I got two. I got a face one and a makeup one, like, like skincare and makeup. So this is one of my boxes. Um, so obviously I'll open it for you guys first so you guys get the first view of it. Um, I have already taken off the tape, which so saves, saves time doing it and everything. Um, but yeah, so this is the first look into the box. I haven't looked into it yet, so this is literally the first time I'm looking into it. Um, so yeah, so I'll obviously take out every item individually and uh, chat about it. If that makes sense. So, when you first open the box, you get a Gora card and it has like a thank you thing. It's like, thank you. It says, we hope you love, the, love discovering these products. Don't forget to share your take on Agora and as a thank you, we've gifted you an Agora coin to use towards your next beauty treat. Yay! So I get coins now for um, both boxes, which is very nice. I think they, get, they add up to, I think the amount of coins you get gives you a bit of a dis more of a discount on it. I think, you can have work. I'm not too sure. Uh, you also get an Agora sticker, I think. Yes, a lovely Agora sticker. Um, I'm sure I can find somewhere to stick these. Uh, but yes, so on product based uh, thing first, this is the um, skincare one. Uh, first thing I see is this big body scrub, which uh, body scrub number three, which from e-cooking, I think. Yeah, from e-cooking is vegan and it moisturises and nourishes the skin. It's got a fresh scent and it smells of jasmine, grape and orange flowers, which sounds really, really nice. Oh. Honestly, so this is what it looks like. It's got a nice, it's got a nice texture to it. It's an oil oil based, so it's, so it's nice. I think it'll make, it'll make your skin really, really nice and soft. Um, my only issue is with it is I'm not keen on the smell. I think the scent, I can't think of the word to describe what the scent smells like, but it's not what it says. Um, I think, I think because it's natural and organic smells, it's nothing like, there's no, I don't know what it's called. There's no like proper fragrances in it, so artificial fragrances, I think. I don't know. But it, because it's organic and natural, it smells organic and natural. There's not a very potent smell of oranges or grapes or jasmine. It's very, it just smells organic, pretty much. But uh, it's all right, I'll, I'll use it, obviously. Um, but I'm just not a fan of the smell, which is a, a little shame, but hey, as uh, someone says, 
never judge a book by its cover so I'm not going to judge this until I try it. Um, that's the first product. Then I'll go to the Grace and Stella Blackhead Face Mask Remover which sounds very exciting. It says blackheads are no fun but removing them can be. So that's that. This. Um, obviously get your instructions back and the ingredients and everything is the directions in every single different language. So your ingredients on it and it also tells you how long you've got with it once you open it, which is very, very handy. I don't know if anyone knows this, but down here, there, it's got a little uh, bottle of 12, with 12M. So it's 12 months as soon as you open it. Um, if anyone didn't know that, there you go. Um, this will tell you how you've got a year with it, which is nice. Um, I'm not gonna open this one yet. No, actually, I'll open it. I'll open it see what the actual thing looks like um i like the uh pastel pinks and there is subtle pink to uh, to white on it i think it's very classy and very it's not too in your face but i like it i think it's very classy um, a classy and elegant kind of um packaging for it um so yeah you just it's just just that nothing extravagant pretty much just like a squished version of that um but yeah it's obviously sealed so you know it's brand new which we love and it is black so you can see in there it's a black face mask so i always find with the uh, face masks the the black ones, I find they get right in the skin and I love it so much. Like, you know you're going to get a good job with, it, with these because I don't I think it's charcoal in them. Yes, it's charcoal. I find that really digs out pores, which love it. Uh, so that's that. Then we have the Intimate Wash, uh, face wash, which is this. This one and... This one, I'm by the same people, that the e-cooking. Uh, this one's fragrance free. So, yeah. Honestly, not got a lot of high hopes for this one since I'm not a fan of the other one. But again, I could be wrong. I'm not gonna judge it yet. It smells the exact same. It said it's fragrance free, but it's obviously not, but it smells the exact same as this. But hey ho, we'll uh, we'll give it a try. See what see what it's like. Who knows? It might make my skin look like a newborn baby's. Would not complain. But hey ho, um, this is that one. And then finally, I got the twenty four dots. Twenty four dots. Dots for spots. It is. Um, Mini stickers to like house something dots things designed to draw out impurities from your spots, providing a non touch healing environment and acting as a protective cover from the breakout causing bacteria. So basically, tons of little dots that you stick on like your spots and it draws everything out of them, so you don't have to pop them and touch them, which is really really good because it stops obviously your oils and your skin on your hands getting to it. Obviously. We touch so much with our hands at the minute. I know with that COVID and everything, we're all sanitizing our hands. But if you look at the grand scheme of everything, we still touch stuff a lot. So more than we're touching our face, and it's just what you think about is a bit grim. But uh, so that's very handy because I think um, maybe it'll draw stuff out without giving it on your face all blah. Um, but yeah, that's the first box. And again, you get these two. Uh, that's the first one. So this was the, this was the uh, skincare one. Oh, and then obviously you get tons of this stuff, which um, my fire will enjoy. Um, okay, second box is this one. So this one did get a bit squished. My uh, postman squished it a little bit. But, you know, hey, hey, we're all human. You'll make little bit of little mistakes. Um, but yeah, this is the second one. 
this again I have a undone the sticker on it so that it was easy to get into um so Oops. oh oh god ah. well that didn't work uh before I tipped everything out of the box it was very nicely done uh but yeah so I'll quickly um put all this stuff back in and then I'll show you what's in this box okay done so obviously same principle backing get a card again with the again exact same message on the on the front of it you also again get a yellow sticker um okay first product is the benefit pore uh super setter so it's setting spray um i've been dying to get a new setting spray for ages just haven't obviously had the time or well, can't go, and go out and get some because i um i don't know where i get mine from i get mine from body shop but i don't like ordering stuff online for sprays and stuff unless i've already tried them before this one i have tried and i love it so i'm very very happy that i've got this one um long lasting makeup set spray so this is very handy only thing is i won't use it until i wear a full face makeup which won't be anytime soon sometimes uh, but yeah so because again obviously with work i have to wear a face mask all day and obviously um i just grab one you all know that a face mask covers you to about there so there's no point me actually wearing makeup because half my face is covered or more than half so um i just tend to put mascara on and a bit of concealer under my eyes that is legit literally it all day there's just no point um so this is very very handy but just not right now it'll do for a night out don't really have soon. Um, then I've got also the liquid highlighter, which is if you can see that, you can't really see it. It's not very clear. The liquid highlighter from Le Splash. Um, Le Splash Cosmetics. You can see that there? Yep. Uh, this is in the shade Beam, which is two two one o one. If you want to try it. Um, so this looks like that it's a really, really pretty colour I think it will look very very nice okay, on um, pale to um, uh, tanned skin if I just try and ah there we go did it if I just put it in my hand so that's it on my hand and obviously uh, I'm gonna do is waste it. There we go. If I dab it. It is a very, very pretty, pretty shade. Um, it's not. I find sometimes liquid highlighters can be very gooey and not the nicest. But this, it gives that really nice subtle glow, which I like. And I'm definitely be using that. It's a very, very nice liquid highlighter. Uh, but yeah, so that's colour. Yeah, any better um but yeah uh like it love it definitely be wearing it uh then if we jump into the box again we have the um okay illuminating serum this one oh the box is falling apart uh, illuminating serum which uh, retains moisture Pumps the skin. It's got hydrochloric acid, hy yeah, hydrochloric acid, and vitamin B3. This comes from France, so already you know it's going to be good, just from being from France. Um, I've never known a product from France that's not been good. <laughs> so, um, so this is what this is what this looks like. It's a very lovely little packaging for it um easy applicator obviously it's just that so you do dot you dots on your face uh, with your little, little pump um so yeah it's really nice it smells nice as well i know i didn't smell it but uh it, you can smell it from when you pull it out but 
it's got a very nice smell to it. Very like fruity, but not fruity, if that makes any sense. Um, but yeah, it is a 30ml, so I think it's a nice one to test it, see if you try it, if you like it, if you like it, fantastic. If you don't, you're not really wasted out. Um, but yeah, so that's the serum. Then I saw something else in this little box. Yes, the um, Lord and Berry for Night and Day Lash Brow Growth Serum. This is what this looks like. Quite small, but I guess you don't really need a lot because your lashes are very small and obviously eyebrows are, there's not a lot there. Um, this is in number hashtag 1603 if anyone wants to try it. Um, sorry, I, I live in the countryside so I have farmers and everything going up so the honk with a farmer. Um, but yes, yeah, so this is the the um, lash serum. That's the applicator. So it's a nice easy applicator, nothing too difficult. Um, but this one I'm actually very, very excited to try. I've been dying to get my hands on um, a lash serum for ages. I actually bought one from a woman on Facebook who um, a month ago who was like, oh yes, uh, it's sent out to you. I thought it's not though because I've not got it yet. A month later, still haven't got anything. And she keeps uh, fobbing me off about my answers and with answers about um, when it's gonna be, when it's gonna arrive. And when I asked for a refund, I said, because you've wasted my time and I no longer want it. It's like, no, you can't have a refund. You have to refuse the, pack the package on on delivery. And I'm like, well, how do I know it's your package if you've not sent it out? Uh, but, you know, long story, and it's a story for another day. Uh, but yeah, so that's everything that's been in my box. If I really quickly, while I'm still nattering away to you, put um, everything in the same box, so you can see how much it fills the boxes like definitely worth it even if um anyone's skeptical about it i say do it because so that's all the products in one box it fills a full box it was definitely worth it there are products in there that i will definitely be using these two are the june um mystery boxes so i had no idea what i was going to get one was $12.99 and the other one was $13.99. Definitely worth it. I loved every single thing in it, apart from this. But again, I'm not gonna judge it. I'm gonna try it first, pardon me, and then see how I think. If my opinion changes, I'm swayed towards e-cooking. We'll see. But yes, yeah, so this is the Agora Box haul try thing. Um, I will be doing some more videos this week, obviously, because again, I've got plenty of time, nothing but time at the minute, so there'll be a lot more coming out to catch up on what I've missed and things like the weeks that I've missed out on recording stuff. Again, really, really sorry, just not being the right headspace to do it. Um, I will definitely be doing this again with Agora again and do another one, like a part two of uh, what's in the, the July um, mystery boxes and see what's and do what's in that one. I might do it every month, do a July and you know, do the July and then so on and so on. Um, that's a plan. If you guys want to see that, tell me, let me know in the comments. Um, but yeah, so tomorrow I'm going to be cooking, uh, cooking, baking, well, maybe baking, making a uh, banoffee pie. I love banoffee pie, it's one of my favourite things to make. It's extremely, really simple. And if you guys want to see me do it, then again, let me know and I'll uh, record myself making enough banoffee pie. Um, oh, last thing as well, if you, if you want to see this as well. Uh, obviously it's because, as I said, my dad's got COVID and um, he's lost his taste. So if you, want to, if you want to do a challenge on him where I fill different cups up with different drinks and stuff, so I guess what it is then I'll definitely do that. If that's something that you guys want to see, obviously it'll be a bit of fun for, well, me and you guys, but probably not for my dad. I was thinking of putting like vodka, all the, um, pickled onion, um, pickled onion juice, stuff like that, like 
grim stuff just so you can guess what it is um but yeah so if you want to see that or anything like that then please let me know um but that's it for today i hope you liked it and if you did please um leave a like click the bell and also subscribe i mean why the hell not also please um please share this video with anybody you know help me get up my subscribers i have no idea how many i've got at the minute but let's try let's try get 50 subs 50 subscribers by beginning of august there's a challenge for you you do that and i promise hand on heart a video will be up every single week no matter what so please share please get tons of people to subscribe it'd mean the world to me it means that people actually enjoy the stuff i make and um that you want to watch more so if you want that thumbs up share subscribe click the bell and that's it enjoy the rest of your day guys